Hey everybody, it's John here from Hat Hanger. I wanted to take a minute and introduce you to the Hat Hanger. I wanted to tell you why I made it, the reasons that I made it, why I made it out of the material I did, and what its overall result is. So to understand that, the first thing we have to do is start with a hat. Now, most people have always hung their hats on nails or screws or hooks, and this is what happens. You're putting pressure on this one central area right here. And it doesn't look that bad from here, but if you flip this hat around, you can see what's happening. You're slowly wrecking this hat. The weight of the hat is pulling down on that one central area, and that's actually starting to misshape this hat. Now, not only are you wrecking your hat, but you're also wrecking your walls because you have to put a screw or a nail or a hook of some type in there. When, are you, when you're ready to remove that, you now have to fill it, sand it, paint it to match the rest of the walls. But what if you have wood paneling? What if you have metal? If you're putting in like an enclosed race trailer, you have metal, you don't want to be putting nails and screws in that. So I wanted to make the hat hanger removable. To do that, we've used three pieces of this foam adhesive tape on here. This is a removable foam tape. We did it out of a thick foam tape so that it would help adhere to a textured wall. That's one of the biggest things. Now, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put this together for you and I'm gonna show you how quick and easy these are and what the outcome is once you have them all set up. So you're just going to adhere the hat hanger to itself on the back, remove the tape on the second ear, fold it over, adhere it to itself, and when you're done, this is now the shape that you have. You can see it's got a very wide brim on it to hold the back of the hat, so now we're spreading the weight of that hat across this entire surface, and that's what it's gonna help maintain the shape of your hat. Now, I said that I did wanna make it removable from the wall, so what we're gonna do is we're going to remove these three pieces of foam tape backing, and all you have to do is just firmly attach it to the wall, I typically hold them on there for about 30 seconds to get the best promotion. So once that's up there, all you have to do now is take your hat, move it up onto your hat hanger. Now you can see that it's putting pressure on the outside of the hat, holding it in place, while also maintaining the shape of the hat. The other cool thing is I wanted this completely hidden so you don't see anything behind this hat. All you see is the hat on the wall. You can take your hats and you can arrange them in different directions because of the outward pressure on that you can actually move these around so you can put them any direction that you want at that point and i can tell you it is removable so i'm going to go ahead and pull this one off and you can see there's no damage to the wall here now the nice thing is this adhesive remains on there for quite some time it's pretty sticky you can adhere it right back up there again we can put it right back up there and i'm going to pull it off once more you can hear how well that stuck on there. So that is the reason for using a hat hangers. They are made out of a renewable resource. I made them out of a box board material because number one, I wanted it renewable. Number two, I wanted it flexible to hold the shape of those hats. Number three, I wanted to make them very affordable. So I hope that helps you guys understand what hat hangers are. Thank you very much. Have a great day.